Hey guys, welcome back to more Pokemon Fire Red. In the last episode, we battled the Future City Gym. Well, we battled the gym leader, Master Kogan. We beat him, and now we're heading to the next next town area called Cinnabar Island. Uh, it's kind of down the route here, so yeah, we're just going to be battling probably a whole bunch of trainers in this episode, so yeah. The sea cleanses my body and soul. My anyway, swimmer Spencer here has two Pokemon. His first one's a Seedra level 33. And his other Pokemon is a Tentacool. Or Cruel, level 33. Anyway, continue on. There's nothing over here. There's no trainers or nothing. So we continue on down the routes. Still no one. Uh, hey, there's somebody. Hey, don't stare or scare away the fish. I'm so sorry. Hey, anyway, Fisherman Cloud has two Pokemon. His first one's a Shelter, level 31. And his other Pokemon is a Coyster, level 31. Anyway, continuing on, there's another little patch of land over the, over down here. And yes, another fisherman. Keep me company till er keep me company till I get a hit. Anyway, Fisherman Nolan has two Pokemon. His first one's a seeking level 33. And his next Pokemon is a Goldeen level 33. And when continuing on down the route. So yeah, another patch of land, but there's nobody on it. But we have some other fishermen here to battle, I guess. So yeah. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna go heal quick. My team's pretty weak right now. So yeah, I'm gonna go heal up, okay. So you guys wanna get back. Okay, so I'm back now, and let's get some ba more battles done. I caught my Pokemon at sea. Really? That's so awesome! Okay, Swimmer Jack here has one Pokemon. It's a Starmie, level 37. Anyway, so we continue on down the route. I think we're almost done, actually. Ah, oh, feel the sun in the wind! Anyway, Swimmer Roland has three Pokemon and stuff. His first one's a Poliwhirl, level 32. Anyway, his next Pokemon is a Tentacool, level 32. Yes, I decided to ev evolve Eevee into Jolteon, yeah. And I also taught it Shockwave that we got from uh, El er, Lieutenant Surge, the third gym leader in uh, Vermilion, City, Vermilion City, so yeah. And his last Pokemon is a Seedra, level 32. Anyway, continue on. Um, yeah, there's a trainer. Another swimming kind of guy. Right now, I'm in a triathlon meet. Yeah, you sure you are. Where is everybody? They're late? Sure. Okay, sure. Okay, swimmer Jerome has two Pokemon. His first one's a Staryu, level 33. And his other Pokemon is a War Turtle, level 33. Anyway, continuing on. Hey, look at that, we're done. So, yeah, guys, welcome back, or welcome to Cinnabar Island. Yeah, down here is the Pokemon Mart and Pokemon Center. So, yeah, I'm going to go heal quick, and then we're going to go check out what's in the Pokemon Mart. Anyway, so, yeah, let's go to the Pokemon Mart now, see what they have. I need to stock up on some items anyway. Anyway, so now they have Ultra Balls, which they had in Fuchsia City, too. Uh, I'll grab five of them. That'll work right now. I'm not really catching that many Pokemon, so yeah, I'll just grab a few. You also have Hyper Potions, which none of my Pokemon are over, like, 200 HP. So, I'm gonna pass. I'll grab a few Revives. Uh, wow, I'm really losing my money that fast. Wow. 
epic fail. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, I'll let that go and buy a few of these. Okay, Wes, quit wasting all your money on just random items. But, uh, one cool thing in, uh, Cinnabar Island here is this place. This is the Pokemon Lab. Yeah, that's very, very specific, you know? Really. But anyway, uh, here, um... You remember in Mount Moon where we uh, found those fossils? You know, we had to battle that super nerd to get one, and we got to pick one because we beat him. Well, here, um, you can revive that Pokemon, and yeah, so you have a that Pokemon. Hi, do you have a Venonat? Want to trade it for my Tangelo? Oh, that's too bad. I found the most remarkable fossil inside Mount Moon. I think it is... It's of a rare prehistoric Pokemon. Maybe... Hello there, do you happen to have a Raichu? Would you agree if we trade for my Electrode? That's kind of a bad ch trade to me, in my opinion. Anyway, uh, also in here, uh... Look at me! Tsk, tsk, tsk. I'll teach you a nifty move. Teach it, it to a Pokemon and watch them fun the fun unfold. It's a move called Metronome. Does it strike your fancy? Nah. Me Metronome is a move that it it's randomly selects a move, like any move ever, you know? And it just uses it, pretty much. So it can be anything. It can range from, like, Fire Blast to Growl. It's, like, all them. Anyway, Eevee can evolve into one of three Pokemon forms, I think it said. Or, one of three kinds of Pokemon. Okay, sorry. Kind of read that fast. Which is like, click, oh, uh, and yeah. Anyway, but anyway, in here is the, this is the testing lab. This is where you actually go to uh, get your fossil resurrected, kind of in a way, if you want to say it that way. Anyway, so I'll pick my dome fossil, and then that's, a, it's a fossil Kabuto. And I'll say, yeah, uh, he'll use his resurrection machine and bring him back to life. But anyway, uh, yeah. Walk outside. Walk back in. You're late. Where were you? Um, I just walked out the door and walked back in. Yeah, I wasn't really far away. But anyway, he'll give, give you your Pokemon that you gave him. There's also a Helix Fossil, which uh, you can get a... Uh, uh, I'm trying to remember now. An Omanyte if you get a Helix Fossil. Yeah, I, I really seriously forgot there what how to pronounce his name. That was kind of awkward fail. But anyway, over here, if you trade this guy a Ponyta, he'll give you his seal. But I'm like, no. And he's like, oh, well. Oh, well. Poor guy. Sorry. Just don't feel the trade. But anyway, why did I do all this side stuff? We should go to the gym. Why not go inside the gym? The door is locked. What? Leader Blaine, the hot-headed quiz master. But anyway, but like, why is it locked? Well, we gotta find this key to open it. It's called the secret key, and it's found in this area, this building right here. It's called the Pokemon Mansion. This, this place is full of fire types and poison types, so yeah. There's Growlithe and stuff like that. And wow, that was kind of luck. I'm like, Growlithe, and then it pops up. I'm like, whoa. But anyway, I'll continue around. There's some trainers in here also, if you want to battle them. I might do them off camera because I just, I don't know. I might do them. I'm not entirely sure. I'll decide that for the next episode. Because I'm pretty sure we're running out of time, but... So, yeah. Scary. He's looking into my soul. Very creepy. Anyway, guys, see you next time on Pokemon Fire Red. See you guys then.